I'm Todd King, and things have been a little different over the past three months. After five years of playing pro football overseas, three MVP awards, I'm currently unemployed, and not one team have contacted me about employment. I'm living as a thug and flight risk because of my way of life. There you go. Superstar, what you say? Yo. <laughs> Shit, I'm gonna think you, I'm gonna thought you weren't coming. <laughs> nah, nah bro. Man, I told y'all I'd be here, bro. You know I had uh, a couple things to deal with. You know what's up, man? No big deal. What's going on, bro? Hey, this is Corey. Corey Wheat. Childhood friend, major in sports management, and now currently my agent. What you doing? What you think you're doing? Sitting in my house, no shirt on, playing my video game? I'm comfortable. You comfortable? Yeah, I'm comfortable. I'm gonna kick you over this. You oh. can try. You know I'm nice. So, look at that weak shit. So, I seen you London. You London? You London? Yeah. Man, what a fine ass. God damn. Whew. So you gonna ask me, you know, what happened, or you gonna sit there and fantasize the whole time? Damn, man, my bad, man. Proceed. So, I mean, last time I seen it was about about six months ago, and everything was cool. Then I see her today, I see she praying. And you know, it's kind of messed up, because I thought we was friends, and found out through Facebook that she was pregnant. I kind of, like, it was rumor, you know what I'm saying? When you get the rumors, you don't really listen to rumors. Yeah, but I mean, even still though, man, you gotta take it easy on her. You know, she hormonal and shit. Told me to take her advice. She told me I need to stop fucking with y'all. What? I mean, you need to drop that bitch. Yeah, I thought she would say that. God damn, yeah, she need to go. Since high school, I've been a standout athlete, Todd King. Everybody wants to know Todd King. High school job. Let's get to Todd King. I'm chilling, bro. I just started y'all was on social media. Like everything that you do got a consistency. Instagram, Facebook. You just made a post like not even 40 seconds ago. But you know he the selfie king, bro. You know that. I do it for your man. They gotta know my every move, B. Look, man, all I wanna do is go out. Hang out, have a good time, have a couple drinks. Y'all can do y'all thing. Everybody just chill. No violence, no tricking, or none of that. Here, come on, man. Really, come, come on, on bro. What? What's you the You must problem? ain't see the 21st Friday. Then you hear <sighs> texting while people talking is Rudy, Rudy, Rudy. All right, man. I get it. Phones up. Oh, Phones up. Obviously, this man has had enough to drink. Everybody cool? Like, I'm, I'm nervous. I ain't gonna lie. I always get some shit when I come home with y'all. So I'm, I'm trying yes, to figure we, this out. We cool. I'm good, bro. Right. right? What? What's up? What? I'm saying you ain't got right, 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 right. Scouts on them. I'm on best behavior. I don't give a damn about no scouts, right? What? What? That's an honor. All right. Man. We understand you a 50 million dollar man and you got you top with free agency. But look, I'm correction, not. Correction. 60 million. Let's get that right. See what 60 I'm million. See, don't don't forget that extra 10. Don't forget that extra 10. Don't forget that extra 10. Always got to start. Exactly. Don't forget that extra 10. That's just all I'm saying. You respect me enough to get my 10. I work for that 10. You got you you got 60 million dollars. You better be able to have a 60 million dollar talk game to get me signed. When one of these 32 teams, are we gonna have a problem, right? Hey, I'm gonna get you signed, bro. I'm gonna get you signed. Hey, but check this out. That's cool. That's cool. Check this out, though. DBC. You can't work for me though if you, if it don't work out for you. Trust me, I got a job for you. You must have need a quarterback. Nah, nah, we good. Nah, I don't need a quarterback. Need a I do need a long one. You, need a you ain't nothing but a 40 reception and you're tight end. Yeah. quarterback. Pure nightclub. The hottest club in the city. Anytime you come to Jacksonville, Florida, you gotta come to Pure Nightclub. 
if you're looking to come see the hottest entertainers from Lil Wayne to Rick Ross to Drake to Meek Mill. So of course, if we're gonna do business, we're gonna do business at Pure Night Club. <laughs> Right, it's got his deal. Fifty million. My bad. Sixty million. Look, I look, that. look, bro. Look, bro. We're gonna be straight, bro. We're gonna get you a deal, bro. I, I already talked to a few teams, bro. We already talked to a few teams, bro. So no, we we're gonna be two, good, bro. You got two weeks. I understand, like, that. Like, really I, listen, I understand that. Listen, I understand that, bro. I understand that. I understand that, dog. You don't think I'm working hard for this? Just like you are. Fuck you know what I'm saying, bro? This, hey, this my livelihood too. We in this together, but bro. It ain't no hey. Home and want me to come out and hang out at these fucking places and shit. It's the same thing, bro. You right, you right, bro. We gotta do this, dog. You understand that? We gotta do this. It's a part of the business. Yeah, dog. We just gotta do what we gotta do. Take care of business tonight. You know what I'm saying? Have us a good night. But we are gonna get this deal, man. What just have, have some faith in me. You know, Rats is the wild card. You know, man. I can talk to him. You can talk to him. But Rats is the wild card, man. J Pimp, Pimp by Day, VIP Manager by Night, and my soon-to-be business partner. If I'm gonna make a move, I gotta make the right move, and gotta make it with this man. Alright, what's the business there, bro? Yeah, we got something going on, man. Oh, man, this is a little something, Seth. You know, living life a little bit. Shit, let's go on the good side of this goose, man. Shit. So, yeah, when we discussed, though, man, I still want to do the same thing, man. The same, you know, 15%. Yeah. Talk. Alright, you want to do it, bro. Like, I'm fucking with you. Yeah, we, uh, let's toast to this good life first, man. Oh, really? The life we live, man. Like, so, you already know, man. We do the biggest shit in the city. Bring the biggest artists to the city. Don't worry about what other motherfuckers do, man. Like, just do me. Yeah, you, you know, know they be hating on people, man. Man, let them motherfuckers hate. That's what they're supposed to do, man. Let them hate. As long as we doing what we supposed to be doing, hate is irrelevant. I'm with it. I'm you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so, about this 15%, you know, again, I'm suspended. I got some, there's some shit that come with that behind me. I'm gonna trouble that with me. You feel me? They say I'm trouble. I ain't been involved in nothing. Okay. My the people that I be with, they get involved in stuff in the hotel and shit happens. People have camera phones and, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Up, see, I feel Anyway. I just want to do me. All right, so, I mean, the shit we talk about, bro, like, we can do this. You know, I bring the biggest city, the biggest artists in the city to the best club in the city. It's just, we got to handle the business first, bro. Like, the shit got to be solid. Like, outside got to stay outside. Inside got to be inside. Like, I don't fuck with nobody. I just worry about what I do. Whatever else, anybody else got going on, bro, cool. But I just do what I do, you know what I'm saying? So. I mean, we do what we do, bro. I'm gonna look out for you. You know what I'm saying? We gonna make this shit work. You in, you in the you in the buyer right now, so I'm gonna fuck I'm gonna fuck with you and make it work. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't take him to get a hookah, baby. Don't take him to get a hookah. Y'all y'all gonna take care of my bro. Congratulations, man. Hey, man. Let's just say I got a good agent. 
You got a good agent. Yeah, man, I got a good agent, man. Why well, your agent ain't working for me? A five-time MVP, six years in the league. It, obviously, there's nothing wrong with my work ethic. Man, you right. It ain't nothing wrong with your work ethic. My problem is when I come home. <laughs> no, it's y'all at <laughs> When I come mean? home, you niggas got problems. You niggas are crazy. What, what the papers read? Maybe it's just your bad attitude. Yeah, you keep saying something about my attitude, right? Since obviously the, the media always misses you and you got the bad attitude. Hey, man. Who jacked the guy up in Waffle House? Yeah, but I asked for the waffles, three waffles. They gave me one, then they tried to overcharge me. But then you got mad because he put a blueberry on the waffle? Like, you ain't I don't like that, blueberry. Right? I like strawberry. Who jacked the bartender up at the last nightclub that we tried to get a, that we tried to get a bit of me out of my drinks. It was a woman, Rex. Just because she yeah, had on fucking jeans and a tank top and look, had she muscles. Dress, she want to dress like a dude, then she going to have to handle the situation like hell. Yeah. I'm not 6'4", I'm not 215, but guess what? I was with you, so guess what? They put my ass out there. Why? Oh, you the league MVP, you need to represent yourself better than that. Rex is a defensive player. He's always aggressive. That's bullshit. You a tight end. You know damn defensive player. I'm not hearing that. You yeah, just play defense by that. They force you to play defense. You offensive too bad. Hey, can I, can I go? Time out, time out, time out. What? Before we get, what the hell is this you watching? It's the 21st Friday. You ain't seen this? Nah, what was this? Like some type of parody of Friday? Yeah, it's funny as shit. This dude, um, Carlos. Lopes? Lopes. Uh, Lopes 2K, what? 2K16? Yeah, Lopes. Remember Lopes? Yo, what's up, man? What you get into last night? Taisha. I'm sorry, what? Who? Taisha? Yeah. Taisha from high school, Taisha? Yeah. Big Taisha. She ain't big no more. 5'3, 135 pounds. That's way more, way less than she used to be. Yeah. She was 5'3 five, five, in high school, 203 pounds. Hey man, she got any friends? She got a sister. Well. 24. Six kids. Miles, bro. Miles. I'm like miles, bro. Miles. But anyway, you need to work at it. You need to be focused, man. I don't think I think that part of my life over me, man. I don't think. I don't, even at 25, man, I just feel like I think it's over with. Like, uh, it's, it's not over, man. You can't have that attitude, man. Look, I got resigned. It's just it's frustrating. You ain't you ain't going through the stuff I'm going through, right? It's, Ah oh, shit, here you go with that pity pot shit. Hey look man, I, I, got, I, got, I got some females to go to man, so I ain't gonna do stuff for stuff like that. I don't need no pills, dude. Antibiotics, they got creams and... Hey look, oh, you just need to stay focused on that. getting the, keeping the groupies around. Cause you know, your groupies love you. My groupies wanna rob me. Yeah, <laughs> remember last time, your ass ain't gonna have no employee. Hey man, gotta get off your high horse man. Tell Obviously, us. I ain't high enough. <laughs> like I said, I'll man, I see you after a while, man. Yeah, man, I get up with you. Hey, we'll talk like, to you later, bro. Yeah, man, I get at you. Man. All right, right. That's crazy. Man. Ooh, my nigga! Man, what you been into, man? Hey, man, no. you ain't shoot nobody lately, though, man. Nah, I ain't shoot nobody yet. No groupies. Now you telling me I can't beef with nobody and he telling me I can't get no bitches, but y'all telling me we're gonna go pop bottles. We gotta have bitches. 